You alright? Tim says he's going to wait until he's seen one or two others go up. He's noticed that when I brought my wing up, sometimes the wing would just flip over like that. Uh huh. He says you've got to choose your moment. Keep an eye on you if you like. Sorry? I'll keep an eye on you if you like. Yeah. I'm scared. I need another poo. What? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Chin strap is seven. Summer. Uh, we are to uh, Banbury, yeah, just south of Banbury. It's nice in that it is only an hour from my house, which is the shortest ever drive to a PMC. Uh, but also, this is a very flat area of the world, of the country. It's not like when we go to sort of places where there's hills, ranges. Nigel's up, nice one, sir. So it's a bit flat, but the weather's damn good. It's a bit strong, windy-wise. So that is Nige did ahead with the blue wing. I'm going to trim out immediately. And I think the plan is we're just going to fly about 10 miles up the motorway here to a hill, which I think I can probably see in the distance over there. Oh, that's a bit rough. Could still be uh, thermals. It's been a hot, hot day. Nice easy takeoff in that wind. Yeah, it's bumpy as hell up here. 
yet again another weekend of strangers coming up to me and saying thanks very much for the videos you got me into paramotoring or you helped me when I was going through training and uh, great to see really great to see very rewarding for me that is you know something like that you think well if I can help one person you know then it's, it's worth it but it's just been loads and it's been great so to you three who came up to me over the weekend, thank you. Somewhere around here is uh, Jeremy Clarkson's uh, Diddley Squat Farm. A few other guys went over to the farm shop on, uh, on their motorbikes earlier to buy jars of overpriced jam. This is not the nicest flight in the world. It is still, what time is it now? It must have been probably quarter past seven, half past seven at night. The winds were supposed to die down a little bit. Hoping the thermals would off, but they haven't yet. Ah, below us is the M40 with all the uh, losers going up and down the motorway. I'm getting 20 miles an hour. It's about 17, 18, 19. an age where I need reading glasses, which is fine, but I've just realised that if I'm to see now that it's like less than a foot from your face, maybe I need a knee thing. Age. Uh, still getting 18, 19, so I reckon that's a 10 mile an hour wind up here, something roughly. I don't know, I'm trimmed out. I don't know what this thing does trimmed out. I've never bothered with measuring speed or fuel burn or any of that stuff. Because I'm not an anorak. Sort of with this channel, I sort of... Uh, sort of tried to explain what, you know, what goes on in training and how easy it is to get into and how to get into it. And, you know, the good bits and the bad bits, there aren't many bad bits, I have to say that. And, and once you've said that, you've said it. And I, I, I can't just keep saying it, making videos just to say the same thing. But I still kind of like the fact that the channel is here to help people. Um, so I'm thinking about accepting some of these offers that I have to go and fly with other people. Which I'm really grateful for, but I don't sort of make the opportunity to... Um, you know, say yes and go to them all. But I should. And, and, and the ones that I have done, you know, have been great. I always remember Matt Ramson inviting me up to Yorkshire. Never met him, never heard of him. Just went up there. Great time. Trashed my kit, but I had a great time. And now he's a real good friend. I love the guy. And, um... So, what about... I, I accept these things and I go to these... Uh, I go and meet these people. But I sort of interview them in the air. We somehow connect our radio speakers up or whatever or do it over the phone. And then get their story of how they got into it and where they trained. And, and you know, just like I said, not an interview, more of a chat. But then it's, it's the same story, it's just someone else's version of it, which I think that could be kind of interesting. I mean, I'm interested to know the answers anyway, but for noobs coming along and finding the videos, or finding Tucker first and then finding these. It's, um, you know, it's not just my perspective then, it's, it's multiple ones. Oh, it's a bit shitty up bit. <laughs> Nigel, you're looking great, mate. You're going a bit faster than me as well. Lovely little takeoff back there. I think Mark Watson's videoed it for me, so I look forward to seeing that. It felt good, it felt calm. It was a nice strong breeze, so it was pretty simple. Just easy reverse, turn around, it wasn't going anywhere. Lean back, off you go. I don't get as much lift as soon as I expect lift. I get a little bit of lift, 
I'll go up, but then I always come back down again for another step or two. I don't know what that is. I don't know, maybe I'm coming off the brakes a tiny bit, sort of subconsciously or something. Well, Nige, we are going to be speeding back down this motorway. There's supposed to be about four of us doing this, four or five, but Nigel wasn't going to hang around. He just took off and went. Yeah, I've got to assume this rockiness is um, thermals. I feel myself going up and down. Going up at the moment. Oop. Haven't seen any other traffic. I wish I brought a bottle of water. I was going to, and I thought, no, I don't need any extra weight. Worrying about nothing. I'm missing my old helmet, the, the RAF helmet with the black visor on. It's killing me. I'm crying under these glasses. I think I see the hut. Right at the sort of end of this ridge. Ugh. No need, no need. Yeah, this is a very flat part of the UK. Look at that.
but they're all flying into wind. They all look like they're battling along, but they're all going slow, and I'm the one going fast. Get down there, have a look at some socks. There's a there's a uh, like a electricity line running right across the middle of the field. So we're sort of taking off away from it and landing towards it. Looks like it's straight towards the tent. Foot cam on. Too late now. 